Vreau să a
first, I would like to talk about how I feel as a woman. Uh, it has been a tough hike, but I can say we are at the peak. Uh, because, like, if you see the schools that we are competing with, which are like the Alliance girls, if you compare them with us, we are quite, we are quite below them, isn't it? Not in terms of education. I know that you can do better, but I'm talking about the facilities. Talking of the lab, which is a single lab, resources, we don't have enough resources. As you've just heard from Marietta, we only have one lab, and during all these activities, science thing, we had to use one laptop, and that is quite challenging because we had six other projects to deal with. So that has been a challenge. So that's why we are uh, requesting if we could be promoted with a team lab so as to motivate the girls. I know we are not the only ones. The ones who are in, who are in yellow. I know they are not the only ones who can do this, who can do science. There are more girls who are there. But when they look at the resources, they say, where am I going to fit? But if we have a twin lab, of course they know they are going to be motivated and they are going to participate. <laughs> okay, and my motivation has been that uh, despite the fact that we have inadequate resources, our teachers, they never like, at times where we are removed from class, they never say that you should do a punishment for this, no. They they pushed us and said that you should do this, you don't know where you will end up. So I thank all the teachers, not only my class teachers, all the teachers, because they have been my motivation, our motivation. The principal who has provided financial support and the space that you have been given. So I am quite thankful for that. And also, uh, challenges that they have just been talked by. Uh, Halim, about how we had to, uh, we had challenges like balancing classwork and science, but we still got through it, we got a way to deal with it. And also the other challenges was fin finance, whereby like most of our project needed a lot of money, like taking the, our casing for our project to Nairobi for 3D printing, that needs a lot of money. But thankfully, we have our Madam Yunis Mwesege, our principal. We are quite grateful that he has been our support to all of you. Um, I would like to, to thank also my classmates, my schoolmates, my fellow scientists that have stood with us. Uh, you know, in some cases, you may hear somebody telling you, what the heck are you doing in the lab all the time you're in the, in the lab? You, you know you're going to fail, but let me assure you, being in the lab doing science is not an excuse for you failing. It depends on how you're going to manage your time. Okay. So don't use something as an excuse for your failure. Use that thing as an elevator to your success. Thank you.